Daniel Potts asked, what are your plans for your future and do you believe that you would need to move to make all your dreams come true? Um, uh, well, that's kind of a hard question. I don't really know. In my future, I, honestly, all I really see or that I really want is just to have my own family. Um, I feel like I've mentioned this before, but yeah, I just want to get married and have my own kids and just be a little mom and have my own family. But I don't really know. I mean, I'd love to. I, I'm not going to school right now. Um, so I don't really know. I just don't know what I want to do. Um, there's so many things I would love to do. I don't really know, but I, I think I would just really love to ki love to work with kids and I don't think I necessarily have to move to make my that dream come true. I can work with kids like anywhere, but like I said before, I would kind of like to maybe be somewhere on the coast, so maybe I need to move to make my dreams come true. Bonnie Love 7 asked, have you ever thought of doing a get ready with me, draw my life, or a morning routine videos? I have done like one get ready with me before. Um, I'll put that in the link below if you want to go watch it. Um, if I remember, hopefully I remember to do that. But I have done one get ready with me before, um, and, but I really need to do a new one because I feel like that was a long time ago. So, And yes, I want to do a morning routine video so bad. I just have yet to be able to um, do it and film it and edit it all. For a draw my life video, I really, really want to do one. Um, I've had other people request me to do that and here's the answer for a draw my life video. I want to do one, but I feel like I need to be a little older to do one. I know that sounds really weird, but um, for some of the things I even want to mention in my Draw My Life video, I feel like I can't say them yet, if that makes sense. I don't know. I know this all sounds like really weird, but I am only 19 and I still have like so much of my life to live and all my stuff is going to be like stupid little junior high things that happen in junior high and I don't want my whole Draw My Life video to be about that. Um, but, and also things I want to mention, I feel like, I don't know, I just feel like I need to maybe be a little older. So maybe when I turn 20 in November, maybe I'll make one then. Not that that's a huge difference. I don't know. I just feel like I need to wait a little bit longer before I actually make my video. It's not like it's going to be bad or anything. Like I have bad things to say about people. I just feel like I need to wait a little bit longer before I do one. But I really, really do want to do one, yes. Shanda Miller asked, who are your top five favorite YouTubers to watch? You're so adorable and I love watching your vlogs. Oh my gosh, thanks girl, that's so nice of you. I love that you love to watch them. <laughs> Let's see my fave favorite YouTubers. Some that I've really been into lately that I've been just like watching a lot more of right now has been Bethany Moda, um, Arden Rose. I really love Megan Rinks, Megan Rosette. Um, I always watch her. Um, oh man, let's see who, well, I really like watching my brother's channel. I love watching them. And then probably maybe Miranda Sings because I just really love watching her. I like never miss a Miranda video because she's hilarious. Brittany Nicole asked, what kind of camera do you vlog with? Let's see, I use a Canon PowerShot Elf 130is. Is that right? I don't know. But I like it, except for the fact that I realize there's like a crack right in there. Um, so if like it hits certain lighting, you see the line like go on my vlog and it's just really annoying. I'm sorry about that. When I save up some more money, then I definitely plan on buying a new camera and one that's a little bit nicer, but I need to wait a little bit before I do that. Paige Simmons asked, just wondering how you got started vlogging. Um, probably because of my brother, um, from his channel, I was on his channel a couple of times and everyone would always be like, oh dear, you should have your own channel, you're so cute, you should vlog. And for a while I was like, well, why would I do that because I have nothing to talk about. And I still kind of get like that sometimes because I'm like, I feel like no one really likes watching my videos because I feel like I'm really boring and I don't go out and do crazy fun things like my brother does, but I'm not as crazy as him. Um, but I mean, I really do enjoy doing it and I was really excited to like start my own channel and everything and I love having you guys watch and seeing my channel grow. It's so fun to bring you guys along with me, but I don't know. It's just, I guess that would just be my brother would be kind of the reason I started vlogging, but I always thought it'd be really fun as well. Creative Crafterful asked, when are you going back to LA and you should do some painting tutorials? I'm hoping to go out to LA um, for VidCon in the end of June. Um, but if not, hopefully maybe I can go in July sometime. I don't really know. Um, and painting tutorials, guys, I tried to do one on my last painting. I actually just finished today. Oh my gosh, I need to go to the post office. Ooh, I'm, I'm glad you said that. Thank you. I tried um, filming it so I could do it, like show you guys the whole painting and take you along with me while I do that. But it did not work out well. But um, 
I have a few things that I know I needed to do instead, but after I finish this one, I am going to start doing like my own kind of paintings, like just for myself again. And uh, I will definitely start trying to film those. Sona F asked, how tall are you? I'm 5'4". Yes, I'm 5'4". Not that tall. Manly Soul asked, so how do you consider yourself when you meet new people? And what are your study plans for the future? When I meet new people, it depends on if I... It kind of just depends. Like, if I met you guys, I would be very outgoing and, like, love to talk to you guys. But that's probably because you guys already know, a, like, stuff about me. And I feel like I already know you. Um, but, like, if, here's... Okay, what are my plans about studying for the future? I still don't know yet. But one thing that makes me nervous about going to college is that I have to meet new people. And I think it's because I get... Like, I get really nervous when I don't know anyone around me. I feel really shy, which is so weird because I feel like I'm really outgoing, but I just, I don't know. It takes me a couple of times to get used to the person, and then when I get used to them, I'm, like, more myself again. But I'm really shy at first and kind of get nervous around people, depending on how well, like, I know them or not. But you guys, I feel like I would totally be just like this when I met you. Well, I know I would be. That's why I was so sad when I didn't get to meet you guys in Dallas because I wanted to meet all my new friends. Queen B Hearts Makeup asked, I don't know why I said your name so slow, sorry. Have you met Kylan and do you miss Audrey? Yeah, girl, I've met Kylan. Um, I, even though I've only met him once, I saw him at Christmas time. I have a vlog when I went there for Christmas, small family Christmas in LA. And I got to meet him and I got to hold him and he's the cutest little baby boy ever and I love him. And yes, I miss Audrey and Kylan like literally every day. Luckily, we get to Skype them a lot. Brett will send pictures every once in a while. And yeah, I do really get, I do miss them a lot, especially whenever I watch their vlogs. I'm like, oh, they're so cute and I can't stand that I have to be away from them. It's just so sad. Iana Robinson asks, would you ever dye your hair and how tall are you? I'm 5'4". I feel like I've been asked that question a lot, but I am 5'4". Um, and would I ever dye my hair? Yes, I would dye my hair, but I'm afraid to do that. Um, my hair kind of naturally gets blonde in the summer, but I did dye my hair once dark on the bottom when I was in like junior high or I was a freshman or something, and I thought I was so cool but I would never do that again because it destroys my hair. But I like that my hair just naturally gets blonder in the summer, so it kind of looks like I did dye it. Oh my gosh, girl, I can't even say her name. Anupataphobic Pulcritudinus. Okay. She said, who is your biggest inspiration? Uh, Jesus? And what are some things you want to accomplish before you leave this earth? Um, I don't know. It's a hard question. I don't know. I can't answer it. Last but not least, Christian Bennett asks, what is your plan for this channel or what are your favorite videos to film? Which I love that question. And um, that's a really hard question for me to answer because I honestly don't know yet. But I also think for one of my next videos, I think I'm going to talk more about that because I have a lot to say on that topic and stuff I want to ask you guys about that um so I want to answer your question but I'm going to answer it in its own separate video okay guys so I actually answered every single one of your guys questions but this video was so long that I had to cut some of them out I'm so sorry but the ones I cut out are ones that I had already been um asked either previously on this video before or ones that I've been constantly asked on other videos so I'll put the links below to some of my um previous ask a dare videos and you guys can go check those out if you didn't get to um, hear your question answered in this video. So, so sorry that I didn't um, answer your question, even though I did, but so sorry I didn't put your question in this video. Um, I feel really sorry, but it was just extremely long, like over 20 minutes long, like literally it was bad. So thank you so much for asking your questions. I just love you guys and I love hearing what you have to say. This is why like I wanna meet you guys in person because I feel like we could just talk forever and you guys could ask me whatever question you want and then I could ask you all the questions I wanna ask you. Anyway, this is the end of this video guys. Thank you so much for watching. I love you. If you enjoyed it, give it a big thumbs up and share this video with all your friends. And of course you can subscribe to my channel because I would love it if you would. And I love making new friends. So I love you guys once again, stay neat and have a super great weekend. Bye.